Welcome back, everyone. We're going to continue where we left off, I hope. I've actually not pressed continue on a game before, so we'll see what exactly uh, ends up happening. The last time we had left out, we were in that little uh, electrical business shack thing. We'll see if that's still where we're at or what exactly happened. Okay, so we're still there. Excellent. All right, so yeah, didn't really do much after we left. I, I literally, once we ended the last video, I was here. We're still peckish, we're still tired. <clears throat> right, didn't I say I was going to uh, <coughs> try and solve these problems? Yeah, well, that didn't happen, did it? Okay. So yeah, we don't really have much use for most of the stuff we're carrying. So I think what I want to do here is we can kind of use this area as a staging area. Because it does have, you know, the uh, various things here. I'm just going to kind of consolidate everything that we have. Uh, around this area. No, not delete all, sorry. Yep. I'm gonna take everything, I'm gonna kinda consolidate everything and put it into the uh, metal cabinet over here. <clears throat> that way everything's there. Okay. Like I said, we're just gonna toss everything in there. I'm going to throw my dirty rags in, too, I think. Mm. The problem I think we're going to run into here is I might not have enough bandages and rags to last me very long. Okay, so I think this is what we're going to kind of hold on to. Uh, we have, of course, our ripped sheets or pencil to mark stuff down if we need to. Uh, we got uh, canned corn in that because we're obviously a little hunger here. And then everything else is currently stashed in here. Um, I guess let's remove the bandage and see what the damage is. It is infected. Okay, so we need to use our sterilized rag. Well, you know what? Let's use alcohol wipes first. And then we'll go ahead and use our sterilized rag as well. All right, just to double, hopefully disinfect it, right? All right, and then we'll go ahead and take the alcohol wipes. Go ahead and put them in there. Where was the dirty rag? There it is. Okay. So, <clears throat> it's about to be night. And that means we might be able to move around a little bit better without being seen. We open up our map. This is kind of like what I think we're going to do. So, last time we kind of ran around over this way with a bunch of zombies. So we want to head... I guess this would be the south, maybe? We want to head this way over here. And then we want to go down this way and try and get to this place. If we can get here, we might be able to find some supplies or something. Uh, or at least try and get, uh, if we can get like a safe space around here. That would be very helpful. Because then we could make our way down to where I previously died and hopefully uh, get some of that stuff back. Uh, but kind of what the, the plan is for right now. So, let's go ahead and get to it. And unfortunately, my uh, frying pan is, is getting down there, so I think what we're going to have to do is try and avoid things as best we can. Um, yeah. <laughs> I was really curious about that uh, brown box on the, the map there. And I don't know why. Oh, now I'm a little bit thirsty. Damn, I should have took a drink before I left. Oh, 
I wish I knew like when to take these bandages off. I guess when I'm no longer in pain and stuff, right? Okay. I'm just gonna go a little bit further this way. Is that a berry bush by chance? Like right here? No. Looks like it, isn't it? Okay. Let's head south now. The thing is, don't I also take... Like, can't I hurt myself by going through shit? One thing I don't really want to do. If I take more damage to my body parts, it's going to be a pain. So I think we're going to... We'll follow this down and come out down here. And then see what we're going to do after that. But as it gets darker, they should see me less, right? At least that's the hope. And I really don't want to run, even if it is dark out. We'll just keep heading south. We really need a better weapon. <clears throat> that is like top priority for us, I think. Getting a better weapon. There is one zombie right there. I do not like that. Let's remove and rebandage real quick. Since it's not infected, I'm just gonna use normal sheets there. Okay. Is it just him? If it's just him, I might just bump him real quick. Looks like it's just him, so let's see if we can take him out here. I forgot I'm actually really tired. die already. Oh my gosh. What is happening? Holy shit. That took so long to hurt him. Yeah, we definitely can't fight zombies here. <sighs> Which means I gotta go around that guy. Okay. <clears throat> I think if I try to go after any zombies, it's just gonna be a bad idea. I have something in my hand which gives me courage that maybe, hey, I think I could maybe, you know, kick somebody's ass, but yeah, not in reality. But I just gotta hope that when I come out of these bushes right here, there's not gonna be a, a zombie nearby. Okay. Luckily, he doesn't see me, so we're just gonna keep crossing. Fortunately, there's fucking... They didn't see me, right? No, okay. Unfortunately, there's street lights, which uh, sucks. <clears throat> so now we gotta cross through this thicket, reach the other end, and then cross the road again. Low and steady. I am ridiculously tired. Which means we might need to just really quickly, as fast as we can, find a place to... 
like sleep. Oh, fuck that. What? Yep. Of course, that's how that's gonna go. Alright, we got a couple of boys right there. Alright, that's, that's lovely. What is this place? I, I might just have to die at this point, because there's just too many zombies. Literally, why are there so many zombies? I feel like there's more now. I made a mistake coming out at night. I figured I could be more stealthy, but no. Not when I literally wander right into a bunch of zombies just chilling in the forest for some reason. Okay, maybe we can lose them in a house. Please be open. Yes. That might work in our favor. <clears throat> they get lured to the sound of that rather than me. Of course, that one's locked. Ah, bloody hell. I can't see what's going on. Oh, God. I need to find, like, a, a house to go into. Please be open. Close that fucking door. Okay. Are you kidding me, lady? Come on. They're like coming at me from so far away. I didn't turn up zombie difficulty or something, did I? There's no way. Oh, look, I cut myself on something or other again. Lovely. Love to see it. Real quick. Bandage myself. Okay. At this point, I'm just fucking hopping fences. Into more zombies, apparently. Why are there so many zombies in, like, a little suburban area? Like, there's no way all these people live here. Maybe I can juke in here real quick and, I don't know, maybe just try not to die. Close that door, please. Okay. If I just, like, hide over here real quick. I don't think I have anything on me, right? I have a can of corn, which I could open. eat a little bit of that. Okay. Um. Let's rebandage this, and then I'll see if I can actually go to sleep or something. I may have lost the zombies. I think I want to get back here away from that window. Okay. Well, <clears throat> this is it, folks. This is where we're going to sleep. <sighs> Thirsty. Nauseous. All in all, I'm having a good time. <sighs> I have one more sterilized rag.
Well, hopefully that'll take care of this infection. Okay. Meanwhile, let's see what we have for loot here. Ball peen hammer, I'll take that. Um, let's actually go ahead and equip that as our primary. Uh, and then let's go ahead and just drop the frying pan, because I do not want it. It's a, a bad weapon, it seems. Bag of concrete powder. Okay, so it looks like we are in a, a tool warehouse or something. We got a propane torch. That's neat. Any food or water would be ideal at this point. Like anything I could use really would be just superb. We have tomato seeds, so we could potentially do some gardening. <clears throat> Assuming we survive that long. There's just so many boxes, man. Surprised this place didn't have an alarm system. That uh that's kind of really surprising to me. Paintbrush. What else do we got here? Battery, okay. <clears throat> I think I need a shovel actually to get gardening started. I had a rake, but I don't think that's gonna help at all, is it? But dust mask. I can wear that. That might help with a uh, little something. I don't know what, but could. Ooh, a metal bar. That might do some damage. <clears throat> Let's pick that up. How much damage does that do? Uh, damage is there. Damage is there. I think it does a little more damage, yeah. Equip that. <clears throat> right, can I drag this down to slot one? No. Too bad. Okay. What else we got? Another metal pipe. I'll take that. Another hammer. I think I'll just load up on weapons for right now. I guess. At least I'm going to go to the water cooler in here. Oh, there was. Thank God. We're going to drink to sate our thirst. And then let's go ahead and clean all of our rags here. And we'll replace the one that's dirty and then clean it again. Don't have to worry about this water too much. Uh, we're just going to remove that bandage. And let's go ahead and sheet that baby up. A clean rag. All right. Maybe they've left some snacks in their drawers or something. Leather opener, newspaper. I could use that and read it and kind of settle down. What about the filing cabinet? What do we got in here? A pen. Great. All right. I'm going to sit on the ground real quick. We're going to read the newspaper. Hopefully get rid of some of the anxiety and uh, depression we have here. I can't tell if it got better or worse yet. Okay, well. I don't know where we are at anymore. Let me open up my uh, map. We are currently here. So is there like a, a plant symbol? I guess I can use a four-leaf clover to mark that. Right like there. Okay, so we are kind of close to where... I was at. What we could... What we could do is we could go up to this house here if we can get any food or supplies or anything like that. We're going to go out the back here, though. 
Time to skedaddle. Jesus Christ. Really? Really? Are they gonna jump over? I don't think they can jump over. Not that fence. But seriously, though? Another huge group of zombies? And they just saw me immediately and decided to come over here, huh? That's how we're doing this? I'm... I'm honestly getting a little miffed here. There's no way they saw me from there. Is it because I'm, like, sick or something? Am I, like, coughing? <clears throat> Another huge fucking group. I might, uh... I might just restart a completely new map at this rate. Let's see if I can, like, I don't know, lower the zombie presence or something, because... For me, a newbie, this is, uh... Getting a little, a little hellish. Right, screw it, I'm gonna go out. There's nothing I can do. Zombies are everywhere. I, I, I can't seem to sneak around them. Shame. <clears throat> Such a shame. So, I'm going to just create the thing, and then we'll end the video once we have that done, and then we'll go from there. Or I could just end it now. And yeah, You know what? We'll end things here. When we come back next time, we'll go in and uh, we'll edit some settings. And uh, I guess we'll see what settings we can edit. Kind of go from there. Till next time.